Good morning, YouTube. Welcome to another segment of Battle League with Mags. Episode 4. Today, we are rocking the Aqua Ship, the SS Empress of Canada, also known as the Paddle Steamer, created and uploaded by Aqua. Ooh, okay, I'm getting far enough. Almost there. Pretty soon we'll begin the episode as we always do. So interior, give a nice little shout out right here to Aqua because I'm a very big fan of Aqua ships. Pretty much half of my workshops like all Aqua. Aqua. All right. So without being too much of a kiss bum, so I like this little setup here. Very narrow doors, but it'll allow for a very, very quick sink. Oh boy, it's, a, it's a very cram, cram and cozy. I like it. Right, let's go to the very back. Show a little, little rooms here. Nice little boiler room setup. You got your main bed for the captain. The seat to chillax. Now this, we will hint the ship is scuttleable. Now let's stop going through. Oop. Oop. There we go. Up and out. Close that. Yeah. It's like Pirates of the Caribbean, but lightly futuristic. Ha! Open up the cargo hold. Woo! Hate to keep that open while we're in a storm. Aha! Ah. We are frontiersmen. We shall explore and set sail wherever we see fit. What a glorious ship. Those of you wondering, I'm not actually Irish, I'm Canadian. But I have a bit of a tendency to spruce an Irish accent when I get scared. Alrighty. Let the games begin. Oh boy. Okay, wait, I forgot. Maybe I don't need so much. Why did I put so many megalodons? Why did I. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, okay. Just in case. Good thing. It's the because I did a little test run with this ship already, I had to. had to be safe. And. I took player damage off because I automatically died. Just drowned, bled out, doom. Wow, way to add the goriness. Eh. And I want to get inside. Hey, big guy. Or girl. I'm not going to genderfy that. Get in. Eh. To a seat. To a comfy spot. Need my safe space. Yeah, behind my desk, like an overlord. I love the way that just spins and actually propels the ship forward. So most ships are propelled with, of course, propellers. <laughs> but this ship's actually using, like, I'm gonna hit the wire and smack it. Oh boy. Oh. Okay, are we too small to be attacked? Oh boy, nope. That, that's four Megalodons. Yeah. <laughs> and pow! Pow! Ooh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No way. Aw. Oh, killed the ship instantly. And it's definitely gonna roll. Ah, no! Poop and logging. Oh, ah! Pop, 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 pop. <laughs> that hurt. <laughs> okay. I think he's gonna come. Oh no! He came for a butt. Oh wow! Okay, yeah, this ship's definitely already super toast. Let's see how long it'll last. We won't activate any scuttles. Ooh. Yeah, the engine at this point's completely dead. <laughs> I think the seat. I'm yep, the seat I'm sitting in is dead. Oh, 
Oh, sweet baby Jesus. <laughs> okay, yeah, nope. Okay, that, nope, looks like we're just gonna have to... Oh, wait, what if he hits the cargo hold? The thing, oh, it'll just drop. Oh, yay. Nope. Nope. Oh, no way. He just dropped us in. As if. Ladies and gentlemen, I may have said it before, but this is this is a ship that definitely is not not meant to be surpassed with megalodons. Just because, well, as you can tell, not only are we all already at the bottom. Yeah, it's full of water in here. It's very dark and quiet and scary. Eh. And then the Stormworks music kicks in. I wonder if I can still get out though. Oh, wow, the hatches and everything. Okay. <laughs> Help me. Help me get out of here. Come on, water. Hydroponics. Okay. That makes sense. You just destroyed the whole hatch. And and it's gone. Just like that. It was completely doomed. You know what? You know what? Just because. Since that was a very quick sink. Oh, forgot. Yep. Come on. In. Oh. Ow. Aw. Wow, this is embarrassing. Can you even climb, bro? Get to the engine. We'll just turn that off for a second. You're supposed to technically keep it on, but I'll just do this. And it starts it up again. Woohoo! Could be wrong. There we go. So since that was a very quick sinkage, I figure let's give a little demonstration of its actual awkward sinkage. So just because we're off to bat, he 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 unleash Poseidon. Oh boy, oh. and that's a glitch. Just completely glitched through the ship. Oh, this is a very loud storm. Entering rough seas, Captain. Yeah, um, how can you tell? <laughs> oh, and that seems to be happening a lot now. Okay. Okay, maybe, maybe it's the wind and storm factor. Oh, what the? Oh, I forgot the ship. Yeah, for those of you who are very familiar with Aqua's paddleboat steamer, it can. Uh... Whoa! Oh no! Ah! 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 Poop! I forgot about that. Ah! No! I gotta stop the ship. Ah! I'm not burning. Ah! I might be on fire though. I might be burning. Oh sweet lord, the lag. As those of you who forgot, this is the potato PC. Oh, we are burning. Oh sweet lord, are we ever burning? Someone grab a marshmallow. <laughs> I wonder if one of the megalodons is still around. That would. That would actually be a little bit 
unconsciously unfair. Just to get blown apart by Megalon. Oh, the lag, the lag. 6 4. Oh, there we go. Sorry about that, everyone. There we go. See, as long as we're not looking at fire, just fire bad. Fire very bad. We'll try and open. Oh, the fire lag. Come on. We. Into the lifeboat. Doomage. Very, very well doomed. Oh. Did the engine just die? Oh, that's cool. So he's got it set up. So essentially, no matter what, one side takes on water, but the other side takes on a lot more water. Did the pumps just die? Oh, they did die. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, sweet lord. Down we go. <laughs> One final beautiful picture to finish that up. Hence why paddle steamers, you never really saw th saw them, but the smaller paddle steamers on oceans because, well, <laughs> guys, there's a 30 foot wave. We're screwed. Just, just get off the boat. <laughs> well, I hope you enjoyed this segment of Battling with Mags, episode four. This was the Empress of Canada made by Aqua with the little extra footage there of its actual sinking capability. And if you enjoyed this episode, like and subscribe. And if you have any ships that you'd like to see get tossed around, big or small, hopefully the potato PC can handle it. Just leave a link to the workshop and I'll check it out. Have a good morning.